I don't want to grow up in a world where people who look like my family are killed. I don't want to live in a world where one day if I have children and they're either black or indigenous, I don't want them to feel the same pain. Um, that is what I hope for. I'm horrified every time I think about seeing that and hearing a man says he can't breathe and calling his mom and having so many people stand around and not do anything and having so many other officers stand there and not do anything. They've done this many of times that they're able to do this on recording and not respond at all. The black community is under attack. What do we do? Stay up, stay back. The black community is under attack. What do we do? Stay up, stay back. To be honest, I don't feel it. You know, I hear it, but I don't feel it. You know, my, my role is to speak to the people that want to listen. And I'm glad he heard what I said, because if he's responding, that means he hears what I'm saying. So I, I felt more confident. I felt more empowered when he was saying all that. Yeah. I'd like to say to anybody that sees this, you know, keep on fighting. I love you. Um, if you don't love me back, I'm still gonna love you. And uh, I hope that you know, the hearts of people you know, change. Uh, stay motivated, stay empowered. And uh, that to the day I die, I will fight for who I am and what I stand for. God, God willing.